So, who can remember what occurred the week past? Um, we fought Punchinello. That was actually two weeks ago. Yeah, we just chased him, really. Oh, yeah, sure, we did. Yeah, we just chased him through the and not well. thing. Yeah, we, we chased into him the... to, the, yeah. to the airship docks. And then he got away, and then we um, enlisted uh, Captain Marabones, who flew us on his ship, and then we got attacked by harpies. Oh, no, not harpies. Well, no, not yeah, harpies. Yeah, what? <laughs> it was yeah, a having, you're and... having wishful thinking there, yeah. It was hippogriffs, and I think it was a manticore in there as well. Oh, oh yeah. Uh, then, yeah, Punjanello uh, jumped onto the um, roof of the Orison uh, Cathedral so and we did the stole thing. inside. So, we, yeah, we jumped. We fucking halo jumped after him. New yeah, boy. And leveled up. Yes. I think there was a rope involved, but. Yeah. No. Better falling. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yes. <laughs> Cyrus helps again. What a wanker. The best oh, cleric ever. Did uh, did everybody manage to get uh, Legend Keeper open? Mm hmm. Andy, Richard, Ed, Tom, me. I'm not. I was about to say. There is a distinct of Tom's face here, but it's, it's Andy's profile picture. <laughs> <clears throat> Can you send me the link for Legend Keeper? Because I'm on my laptop whilst eating KFC. Uh, it's in the pit. It's pinned on Discord. Uh, I've also just put it in Discord for you. Okay. You in? I'm waiting for my laptop to respond. What KFC did you get, Tom? Um, the chicken one. Chicken one. Good choice. Good choice. Sarah. Sarah. Rice pudding, yay or nay? Um, if yay. <sighs> no. I just have a thing about eating the skin off of it, so. Wait, Sarah said no. Oh, you said nay? No, I said yeah. Oh, oh yeah. yay. I was disappointed. Now I'm more so. Tom, Tom, are you a yay or a nay? I'm a yay. Exactly. Wrong. See, see Dan, you're, you're, you're chatting to people of sophistication. I don't think I can call you they people. They sit there with their KFC <laughs> on their laps. You're chatting to a household of sophisticates who appreciate... <laughs> Why the things in life? <laughs> dessert. KFC and delirium. Exactly. And that's a highbrow evening, that is. Yeah, it is. Fried chicken and Belgian beer. Mm. I mean, it's a it's a surefire way to make yourself feel really rough tomorrow. But I've got the I, had, I had chicken nuggets and now I'm drinking Straff Hendrick. Yet again. Yeah, are you also like interspersing that with Gavascon, Andy? No, not yet. Not yet, being the optic word phrase there. Anyway, we digress. You are chasing a maniacal possessed bard across the continent. Does he like rice pudding? No, he, li he likes risotto because he's. You're the you're the GM, so you can say that he likes rice pudding, and then we win. Mm, yeah, but do you want to do you want to be like him? Well, he likes rice pudding. no, he likes not rice pudding. He likes risotto because he's de degenerate. So he doesn't like rice pudding. What's the matter with risotto? Does he not like rice pudding? Yeah, risotto is delicious, but he is generous. I'm, look, you need to tell me whether he likes rice pudding or not. I'm not interested in risotto. <laughs> yes, Punk likes rice pudding. Right, okay. Well, he needs to die then. It's going to be difficult to kill him now. We must save him at all costs. Don't worry, you won't have any such qualms when he wants to murder you. So, you observed this punch evacuate his, uh, his airship lift onto the roof of the uh, Orison Cathedral, and you've made chase. You are you have feather pulled onto the roof. There is it's a flat area of roof in the middle of the sort of four pronounced towers. 
and there is an open door in, a, in one of the towers that leads downward. Um, any signs of damage or any traps or anything? Not as far as you can see. I don't think he would have had time. Um, I time wise, it's been I don't know, not long. Um, We're not long. Cool. Um, I guess we go that way, don't we? Go for it, yeah. If I can bust in there. All right, you head into the uh, the tower. Mm-hmm. It's got the door in it, <clears throat> and the spiral staircase leads downward. And the first thing you come across as you go down the staircase is a small landing. Mm-hmm. Uh, that has sort of a, it runs in like a corridor that runs between the four towers at fairly high high up. And on one side, they have some windows that look out. And in the internal area, there's a sort of a balcony that looks down below. Mm-hmm. And below, you can see uh, what will probably be politely described as carnage. There's a, there's a number of um, individuals in... Uh, Vester outfits of varying types beating men in long robes. Yeah. Uh, can we see Punjanello? You can hear him, most certainly. There is a cackling. I th- I think we need to have, well, I think we need to le- like just get through this and get to Punjanello, because if we get yeah. take him out, it'll stop it. Great. If we try and stop these guys now, he'll just wreak more havoc. Yeah, I agree. It's for the greater good. We're going to have to run through more. Yeah, I guess we, yeah, we just fucking, yeah. It's a, it's a, uh, to set the scene slightly, you've got your end. There's a tall tower at the end of the cathedral. You can only see down like a relatively narrow floor space. So you can see like a couple of figures at the bottom, but there is other stuff going on. You're not 100 percent clear as to what, where, you know, what, where, who everyone is. Okay, so we still don't know where Punch is. We can just hear him. But we don't know exactly where he is. No, you're, you're assuming he's nearby, okay. but you can't see him or anyone else. Oh, you can see figures moving around. You can no, you can see some. You you're pretty sure you can see the distinctive kind of Dester look outfits. Could someone sneaky sneak past the fight and assassinate Punch and Arrow? You're, you're, you're at the top of a tower. Like, you're nowhere near him. I guess we just have to, like, yeah, just run down there into, well, closer yeah. into it until we can see a bit more of what's going on. Have you not played Assassin's Creed, Sam? <laughs> <laughs> There's no hay, unfortunately. Are there rafters like roof beams? Mm, yeah. No, not across the space. That would be silly. Mm, that would be really yeah, Assassin's though. Creed. <laughs> <laughs> Are there any large decorative chandeliers? Yeah, what about a big oh. gargoyle? There are also no weird <laughs> mechanical puzzles. Toy. Are they not? Oh, there, are also no, there are no weird mechanical puzzles. But I do need a bit. Does that mean I brought all these bricks to put on the seesaw for nothing? Yeah. <laughs> Damn it. Is there any element of Assassin's Creed in this cathedral that I can use to my advantage? <laughs> no. No, there is not. It was worth a shot, Richard. I'm going to take another beer, I'll see you very shortly. Well, I guess it's time to burn the cathedral down then. Yeah, that's the only way I see it going. It is my faith. Sorry, sorry, hang on. Yeah, mistake, Richard. Uh, Dan, why didn't you burn the cathedral down? Sorry, mate, yeah. No, I Uh, can't do that. Toss your faith on the barbie. (laughs) No, we can't do that. Not unless it's, like, the only way. (laughs) What if we tell you it's the only way? I'll roll an inside check. <laughs> <laughs> I just don't know, I just need to check my inside now before I do that. Um, plus three, I'll take it. I wonder with my plus nine in intimidation if I could intimidate you into burning down the cathedral. <laughs> Ah. I doubt it. I'm a very religious boy. Just check my alignment. Probably shouldn't do that. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I don't know. Chaotic good. I could burn down a cathedral. 
There's a good side to that uh, chaotic that you are forgetting about there, Richard. Uh, punch nose inside. He is bad. No, no, there you go. Burn it down for the greater good. You're good. Yeah. You're solved. I'm pretty sure I saw a spider somewhere in here as well. It's the so. only way to be safe. <laughs> well done, son. Ooh. Oh, Brownie Mountain. <laughs> What's curious, from this artwork, who built a church next to a cathedral? <laughs> yeah, right? That one is, yeah. That's what made me think Dark Souls, because I was like, is that the fucking bell tower? And then this is an Orlando. What do you think? But it's missing Sten's Fortress, so. Church gets yeah. built first, and then something amazing happens there, and they're like, well, this isn't good enough, let's build a cathedral. <laughs> <laughs> it's from a rival religion. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, one of them collects well, this... tides, the other one doesn't. So. <laughs> this, this, the smaller one is actually just Jehovah's Witnesses. They actually are going to knock on the door of the bigger cathedral and try and convert them. All right, let's burn down the smaller church first. <laughs> I do that, I get you done. So you are on the list of landing, I guess. Um, but there was obviously one, the one spiral staircase you came down and carried on further down, but there was another one on the other side of the church, uh, the cathedral. So there's a pair that seem to mirror one another. Yeah, we're left and the right. Sounds oh. like split the party time. <laughs> that is never a good idea, no. Alright, um, well, we've got to make a decision quick. Which, uh, down or across? I reckon... Down. I reckon across uh, yeah, I reckon down. down because let's get to lower levels so we don't fall off and break our neck. Yeah, we can at least see what's going on then. Um, yeah, Meryl seconds that. So left or right? Well, whichever one was closer. Whichever one was down. <laughs> no, both down. No, so sorry, you missed a point. So you came down a spiral staircase and came, yeah. out, came to a landing, and you came out yeah. on a doorway that led onto a led out out to where you are now. Yeah, that spiral, stair- that spiral staircase carried on down. Yeah, sort of in one corner, but in the ref- in the corner on the other half, like no, that's right. This is the left. original one. Then we'll do the original the, staircase we're on. On the left hand side is is another staircase that doesn't go up, but does go down in the same way. Mm. Yeah, I I guess yeah, we just continue on the staircase we were. Yeah. Yep. Unless it, yeah, if we can't see that Punchinella obviously went that way, there's no real difference. Is there any sign of which way Punchinella went? Uh, roll perception. Yeah. Not terrible. Uh, Meryl with, with an impressive. Uh, squint looks over the balcony briefly and ascertains that someone was pushed off the said balcony. Oh, uh-huh. so it means that he probably moved across here towards the other staircase. Mm. Well, he at least came onto the landing. Okay. All right. Yeah. I. I. Yeah. Okay. Meryl. Meryl changes his mind. He thinks it's this way. All right. <laughs> You're going oh, left. Left. Left it is. All right, you uh, you continue down the spiral staircase, and it it's a lot. You, know, you could see it from afar when you before you came in. It's a long way. It's a big staircase. It's a big uh, cathedral, and uh, you 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 make it eventually. You make it near the bottom, and you'll have to bear with me slightly because this is a, a small space for lots of people. Hmm. Sounds cosy. It does. It's lucky none of us are already quite hurt. <laughs> <laughs> just, just bleeding. <laughs> oh, I'm only a little bit hurt. Thank you, Tilly. All right, and with that, you emerge at the. Well, you find the bottom of the staircase, and there is an open door that leads out into what you assume is a cathedral. <laughs> Fucking get in. Oh, I can't see anything. 
I have zoomed out on this map. It is quite chunky. Oh, this is the big one Sam was talking about. Oh, dang. You should be able to see something eventually when you find your tokens. Yeah, I'd ask, uh, please please don't, don't just I'm, move wallet. Don't move wallet nilly. For now, I you can are. see my token, but everything, my token is just sitting in a sea of black. Uh, cool. Uh, oh, try I moving. See you but... seem to be. Right yeah, you're in a me. pillar for us. <laughs> try move oh, one. Sorry, Okay. I can't move. Oh, there, oh, there we go. Yeah. Can we can we dress up in um... women's clothing and hang around in bars? Yes. Yeah. No, can we dress <laughs> no, no, up? Yeah, don't 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 run around like willy nilly just yet. If you can we dress up in robes like Dad's Army and then turn up singing all things bright and beautiful, but actually have guns underneath? We have to uh, we have to stroll up more nonchalantly. Yeah, and then. And then the Germans are like, "Get out of the, get out of the town hall." And, and the vicar as well is like, "I need this, I need this hall for it's a young mothers' club." It's a cake sale. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately, we didn't bring our vicar costumes, so I think we should probably just decide. Okay, let, let's we'll have to try to sneak in. Yeah, I think we'd also stand out in a room full of jesters. <laughs> that too, yes. <laughs> I'm I'm thinking we don't want to alert them the moment we set foot in the door and have to fight our way across the hallway. What about but jester costumes? We didn't bring those either, Tom. We really weren't thinking. And in hi in hindsight, just... jester costumes is a really good shout. But <laughs> yeah, it would have been better than these bunny outfits we brought. But whatever. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, eight. One, two, three. I guess, what, are we just trying to identify Punchinello? Well, yeah, I mean, I'm assuming can if we can him. kill Punchinello, you can see him. Yes. He's in the middle. I vote we just go in there, then. Why are All we right, um, faffing about? Why? Right. Yes, I just speak. before we go in, I'm going to cast a Spirit Shroud. That's a genius idea, and I am going to cast uh, Armor of Agathas on myself. Sam, how long has it been since the fight with all of the manticore and everything? 90 minutes, maybe? Cool, don't need to worry about. Um, Mage Armor, already up. Right. right. You, you got, uh, I think, didn't you get a short rest? Oh, did we? believe we did on the... Th oh, yeah, we did, because I was really pleased with it. Yes. Okay. I will definitely cast Armor of Agathos then. Ooh, what did I oh, I'm definitely going to roll some hit points <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, How much HP does short rest give you? Uh, so you can use... There's a button on your character sheet, Tom, for hit dice. You can roll up to half your level, which is currently five, I believe. So you can roll up to three hit dice and regain that many hit points. Oh, that's tons. Ah, that puts me perfectly back to max. <laughs> what a green rolls. Mm. Yeah, I now Speak have, yourself. I have I double have the hit points I did have. <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> I had about, I think, uh, just over a quarter of my hit points left. <laughs> yeah, we did get our heads bitten off, so, you mm. know. Um, okay, I'm I'm at full health, so I'm good to just charge on in. Yeah. All the music I'm... has suddenly started for me. What if me and the other sneaky boy... Sneaked in That's a, a better bit idea. That is get, a better idea. See if we can get yeah. some surprise. Yes. Yeah, By surprise, I mean a whip. Yeah. <laughs> a whip. A whip. Um, I. Uh, oh, actually, I can't really hold an action if they're if we're not in combat yet. But yeah, that's cool. But I'll let them go. <laughs> I suppose. Probably, how far away is Punchinello? No. He is punch now, guys. You can just call him punch. Yeah, but it, gravitas. He is 75 feet away from me. It's quite a long way for backup. <laughs> I, can, I can shoot. He is surrounded by other stuff.
So you guys go. Heal from this. Yeah, yeah. Go, go, sneaky boys, go. Yeah. It's your okay. moment to shine. And Ooh, try not a... to get eaten. That's it. I've got my celestial, um, shiny thing. I could actually just go out there and shine. <laughs> That'd be the opposite of sneaking. Yeah, I mean, it's an interesting play. Let's oh, no, see how it, it works out. Are we, are we sneaking? I'm going to cast Bless on the two sneaky boys and Krend. Oh, good cleric, this. It's a good idea, isn't it? He's going to end up converting me by the end of the campaign at this point. I know. Point. Right, so you're all blessed as well. Lovely. Go on, then. Get out there. Sneaky boys, cool. go. Okay. Go on, get. Go on. Wait, it's me. You go. That is you. <laughs> Welcome to the conversation. Which way has he gone? There. We have our yeah, our, our party's divided nicely into I, sneaky boys and magic boys. I know. I assume Andy will need to roll a stealth check for you, Sam. If he's gonna sneak out then yes. You'll be alright. Right. Right. You can add the bless to it, can't you, I think? Stealth, stealth, stealth. Wait, can I decide who needs to add bless? Can I add checks as well? I think. Uh oh no, it's attack roll and saving throws. That was it. Mm. No. A higher stealth than Samulier. Interesting. Wait, where's he gone? He's in front of the yeah, he's over there. Sneak, sneak, sneak. <laughs> Don't want to. Oh. I'm just going to crouch here and wait for the Slumia to be in. Oh, those are some big jestery boys. I'm seeing some disconcerting measuring going on. <laughs> 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 We try and like get out a little yeah. bit, or uh, okay, all right. I don't know what you want yeah. me to do? Can we try and sneak out as well? Then we all need to roll stealth. We just want to hide behind this like pillar, <laughs> <laughs> just so we're at least a little bit closer. <laughs> Sneaky boys! <laughs> oh my! We got uh, twelve, thirteen, and fourteen. We're getting better. Hang on, I've got a stealth. 17? Fucking hell, he has plus 10 to stealth. Yeah, oh, no. yeah, he is a ranger. I don't know why he didn't go with the sneaky boys. I assume he was part that. of them. <laughs> <laughs> just tell them, I'm so much better at stealth than these guys, but I'll just stay here. <laughs> hmm. yeah. He was so stealthy, we didn't notice he didn't go with you. Just doing right, some fun. Just move up. If you're sneaking, I'm going to say you move half speed, so you can move like three times. How do you have such high stealth? He's a ranger. Okay. Ranger? Yeah. Plus ten. Can't work out yeah. less on that. Does he? Do you have? He's got expertise in stealth. Yeah. Oh, I forgot about. I forgot about expertise. Fam. Yeah. Dexterity. All right, uh, Meryl, you haven't noticed, so you could move up a bit more if you choose. Um, push me like. All right, I'm right behind you. Lovely. You're a lot smaller than I am, though, so you stay in front. I'm trying to. I'm just. Yeah, I'm. Uh, I'm <laughs> at the corner, just looking round. Oh God. The tabernacle. Oh, there's a lot of there's a lot of dead people. Oh, oh. Right, I'm. I'm. Uh, can I weep? Who's <laughs> insane? So, uh, old Mister Punch was um rolling uh perception checks as you were sneaking like consistently throughout that, <laughs> and it took him until then to actually roll high. The new one stealth. Oh, not bad. So you did what? Well, literally, his first roll when it was just the sneaky boys. He rolled a uh, he rolled a twenty. Well, so I had twenty one. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and then after that, you guys came out and he rolled like a bunch of fucking dog shit numbers. 
Have you done all this? Yeah. Have we encountered one of these guys before? What these guys? The bit, yeah, the big ones. Big. I uh, so, no. no, I don't think so. No. If we had in the tunnel, was something different. Enough attention. That's a bit disconcerting. Oh, you can yeah, see all need... the measuring. <laughs> I mean, we can ignore the little ones because they'll just be helpless bystanders. But I th well, I think I think the big ones are so going to pack a punch. <laughs> Yeah, thank you. Are we all... Wow, that's an interesting server. There we go. Right, are we all ready? Mm-hmm. I don't think I've ever been referred to the turn order before. I don't like it. <laughs> I don't want to do it. <laughs> Whip! <laughs> Oh yeah, I mean, I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to whip him, then I'm going to hide. <laughs> <laughs> the whip the is so good, because you don't need to disengage, because you're already... Like, if we encounter somebody with reach, you're fucked, but at the moment, you're great. Yeah, the only reason I took a whip is because the flaw I rolled was, I take great solace in flagellation. I was like, that sounds like whipping to me. <laughs> yeah, it, it's working. Oh? Naxal, the turn is yours. Oh. You are... So, sorry, allow me to set the scene. You're on a towering cathedral. It's, it's ornate to the point of ostentatious, but still tasteful. It's, um, there's, a, there's a fair amount of white going on. There's a bit of gold. Um, there's a whole lot of light. Um, there's also a fair amount of blood spatters. There appears to be a number of monks who've been thrown from the balcony above. Others have been murdered in various disgusting fashions by the, uh, the, the jesters you see around you. Um, there are some very tall pillars holding up the roof. There are two very, very tall, skeletal-looking jester individuals, um, and a number of other sort of more humanoid, standard-looking, thuggish fellows in jester outfits. And your, your nemesis, Mr. Punch, is present as well. It is it, there. The, the smell of blood is coppery in the air. Copper, so, you say. Before I whip him, has he seen me, or has he just spotted someone? You're not sure. You'll find out if Sam lets you have sneak. You saw him start. You saw him sort of, you know, notice somebody, but not immediately clear as to whether it was you or someone else. In the same direction, vaguely the same direction. Weep. <clears throat> okay, well then I weep. Weep. Twenty-four um, hits. <laughs> A 12 will miss. If he's surprised, it would be advantage. But if he hasn't seen me... <laughs> if he's hidden... I take. Or does that mean he's not hidden then? <laughs> no, he's, pretty, he's probably hidden, I will grant you. <laughs> 11 damage. Also, just think about it, you would have had to be able to add the bless to the 12 anyway. Oh, yeah. Uh, and because I've got this nice the whispers of the dead um, <laughs> no that's the wrong one no that's, that's not the right thing nor that no. it's uh, whales from the grave <laughs> I can do half my sneak attack damage again to something else within 30 feet oh wow so uh, yeah Phantom Rose is sick that is cool big big boy gets mm -hmm. Half that sneak damage. No, you roll half the number of sneak attack dice for your level, rounded up. Again. Mm. So it's not it's not the one you've already done, you have to roll a new sneak attack. Oh, and my sneak attack rolled wrong anyway. I missed a dice. I've got three D six now. And you round up so it'll be two D six, I imagine. You need to roll me 2d6, please. Right, good guy takes a hit. Does that conclude the turn? Uh, I bonus action hide. Roll stealth. Wait, did you go for a Salumi, uh, for Punchero? <clears throat> I did, yes. The rest of us can go for Salumi, if that helps. 
Sorry, I've been, <laughs> been, I've been, I've been I've been That's and alright, yeah. Really parts of my lander, so I haven't really been paying attention until now, but I don't know what it is. Oh, yeah. All right. Right, I'm going to shoot him with my bow. With snack tack. Do I get advantage? If you're hidden, you will. <laughs> Am I hidden? You are. And that hit. And I get... And then I'm gonna hide. Well done. Cheeky boy. <laughs> Got it. Um. Right. So is where about is um punch? Is it over here? I can't see. Uh, no, he's down here with us. Us. I can't see you. He's yeah. in the middle. Get it, okay. But... So I'm going to... Oh, my screen's too small. It's frustratingly small. Okay, I'm going <clears> to... <throat> what, what? Who's... Uh... Okay, I've got the six movements, so I can potentially run all the way down there. Your movement's basically Three. Okay. So, bear with me. I'm having to move lots of windows around. Um, so, next. So, this is Punchinello. Yes. Yeah. Okay. How much range on crossbows do I have? Um, 30 range, so that's six. One, two, three. Oh, I need to get close, don't I? You can measure. There you go. That would be 30 feet. 30 feet. There we go. Yeah. Gonna shoot him. Are you Re revised ranger gets double attack at level five, right? Yeah. Yeah. Good. Uh, Twenty three will hit. Yes. And I get um Colossus Slayer. And I get favor foe, which is one d four. Another one. Seventeen. And then I'll take my crossbow expert, so I can use my second crossbow to attack. Don't you get a second attack anyway? Yeah. So I think I can do that. Yeah. Uh, is that hit? Yeah, twenty four hits. And then oh I get uh, twenty three hits. So, eh? do you cross the player every single attack? I think is it once? Is it? I thought it was once per turn. turn? Oh, oh maybe it's one's 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 turn. Turn. Oh, it's fucking broken. <laughs> that would be <laughs> fucking crazy. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks for oh, being here. Nuts. Yeah, okay. <laughs> um, okay. 
But then I have my second attack. Yeah, once per turn. Okay. Yeah, you still want to attack, attack yeah. yeah. But then I have my second attack, so I'm going to attack with my crossbow. That misses. But then I get my crossbow expert, so I can attack him. I think crossbow expert... That's your third. Action. You've already done your third attack, haven't you? Uh, crossbow expert <laughs> is when you do an attack action. So no, the attack action means you, you can, can take one attack, 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 attack action. action. Yeah. So you've already, you've already done, done it. You don't, like, double attack doesn't let you use another bonus action. You only get one. Yeah. It's basically, Tom, it's saying that when you use your attack action, you hit them twice. But you have already got something that allows you to hit them twice, so it just allows you to hit it an additional time. Yeah. Okay, so and that was the additional time. So, so yeah, you, yeah, you have the bonus action already, basically. You were, yeah. Well, yeah, your, your attack thing gets, lets you do two attacks, but your bonus action is still against that once. Yeah. Okay, so I've got three attacks. Correct. Three attacks, currently, yeah. Okay. Which is well, it's fucking bad. Fucking, <laughs> it's still fucking crazy. It's insane. It's insane. <laughs> <laughs> A level five, your, three attacks. If you'd hit, your, um, your favorite throw would still apply, I think. I think it's only, only the first time you hit them. Yeah. Um, was it? Yeah, it's only the first time you hit them. Uh, third paragraph down. <laughs> Impressive all the same. For the first time you attack it. Friend. Uh, are we done, Tom? Yeah, that's it. Friend. Okay, so I'm going to move forward. One, two, three, four, five, six. Howdy, Naxxer. No, I've picked up Donnie. Ah, hang on. <laughs> <laughs> Get back, you go. <laughs> I forgot. I, I still have the ability to control Donnie because the went just, wasn't here. Just the horror in your voice. <laughs> I, I, I literally just fixed that. Thank you. Um, okay, I'd like to run here, and um, so I've still got my armor bag this up. I'd like to use my bonus action to cast hex on this boy. So if you could just put a marker on him, that'd be terrific. Um, and I'm going to cast Eldritch Blast twice on him, unsurprisingly. So, Pachu, Pachu. With Blessed Counts, all of those? Uh, it's one spell and it's two beams, so Bless, yes? W would it count if I attacked twice? Just whenever a target makes an target attack. Makes right? attack right? So is I'm that a D4? D4, yeah, boy. Okay, uh, that's for the first one. So the first one is 19, and the second one is 12. <laughs> right, the first one hits, the second one is not. Okay, so it does uh, 6 damage plus 3, 9 damage. I need to add on my hex stuff onto this, sorry. I'll, I'll sort that out in between rounds, um, but that will end my turn. Yes. Right. Punch, punch looks irritated at your persistence. <laughs> he cackles in an unpleasant, with an unpleasant shriek, announces it's a uh, matan. It is. He's on the turn order. How does he know we're taking turns? It's so meta. The bastard. <laughs> is he Deadpool? <laughs> <laughs> Sam's just got Sam's that idea. Just... Um, not quite help myself the major thing is that Krend is the only one he can see <laughs> <laughs> we live in hope alright he's going to take us in fact he's not, he's not going to move oh no that's much worse but he does gesture and spell Oh, bloody hell. 
Bloody hell. Oh. What's Andy reacting to? What have I missed? This was all getting a bit. <laughs> I, just, I, just, I just stood up. Oh. <laughs> uh, I feel like that. Stand up. <laughs> no, I'm just going to take some beer downstairs. Because I'm done with this. <clears throat> I'm pour myself another glass before I take it downstairs. Those of you who weren't here early, earlier, Andy's drinking 14% beer. Lovely. All right, I've, I've made that mistake. Can I get a Constitution save, please? From Slimia, Natsor, and Krend as Punch slaps his hands together with glee and a wave of noise and violence <laughs> erupts for him. Well, I do fail. <laughs> Bless. <laughs> bless. <laughs> yeah, yeah, bless. Yeah. Oh, no. It was it was mostly for Naxor, if I'm honest. <laughs> can I add bless? You can. See if we get a nice but round. You did 30. get a nat twenty. So. <laughs> I'm assuming I've passed, so I'm going to take this beer downstairs. Uh, you take. Uh, Andy takes seven uh, thunder damage, please. Uh, and... I have advantage. I don't care. Take seven thunder damage. Yeah, careful, Andy. You keep talking. You're gonna make it eight. I don't really want. To... I am just gonna switch computers. Oh, okay. Two minutes. I'm assuming that we take fourteen thunder damage. You take fourteen thunder damage, and you also flung ten feet backwards. Uh -huh. Away Okay, uh, one thing is that he takes 15 cold damage. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait, hang on, is it? Ah, uh... oh, no, he doesn't. It's only melee attacks. Uh... I'm, assuming, I'm assuming that would unhide me as well. Yes. That's good. If you, were, if you were hidden, would you have had a advantage at all? It's uh, oh, I don't think not on an AoE attack. AoE think. attack, right? Age, so no. He he knew. The thing is, Slumia and Maxwell both succeeded on my stealth save, so he knew they were there, but he didn't know where. Yep. He took no a punt from being fifteen feet away from him. No, I hadn't. I hadn't realized it was the AoE. <laughs> Did you take a punt on us not fucking moving? <laughs> yeah. yeah. And just be like, mm, you can't see me. It was a good punt. And then, with a grin and a chuckle, he is briefly surrounded by silvery mist. Oh, no. Oh, this cunt. No. <laughs> oh, what's that? <laughs> it's it's alright. He has my hex on him. That means... Uh, 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 nothing. Fuck, damn it. He's over there! Uh, I, it doesn't mean I know where he is. That's irritating. Oh, but he's well, over Meryl there. can see him. Right. Meryl's shouting good. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you might just need to move around the pillar. Oh. I'm back. The game is afoot. Alright, uh, Meryl. Yeah, Meryl's just... A... He's over there! I can see him! I'm, I'm, don't worry, I've got it! <laughs> and runs over here. Um, I'm gonna get kind of... <laughs> over... Here... And then I'm gonna, because I don't have enough um, rate, like dip speed to get to him. I'm gonna uh, use my bonus action to get into my blade song, and then I'm going to cast um, scorching ray at second level. Uh, uh, so that'll be three of these. Boosh. Shit. Boosh. Shit. Boosh. Shit. <laughs> Fuck. Snog on too well. Meryl does not have good luck with this spell. <laughs> a punch grins at you with a mouth that should not physically be able to be that wide and says, You're laughing in there, man. I like he slowly turns right. from a puppet into Pennywise. Cyrus is going to move. <laughs> One. Two. Four. 
five, six. Um. And I'm going to cast um oh actually what's the range currently of how far I am from punching it though? Oh well enough. Mind sliver on punch and So I can make a DC fifteen intelligence save. Is he 15 in time, so you say? Yeah. <laughs> he passes. Okay, well, then, fucking nothing happens. Um, And then... As a bonus action... I'm going to... Sidekick this this guy here five feet away from me. So he has to make a DC fifteen strength saving throw. He passes. Fucking never mind then. I'll go home. That was an impressive roll. That's that's <laughs> my go. I'll go home. See you later. <laughs> Bye. Cyrus. Cyrus is done for the day. I uh, no, that's my turn. The tall skeletal individuals make their move. Oh dear. Oh no. Oh dear. <laughs> oh dear, oh dear. Bye, Lapsa. Oh dear, oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. <laughs> oh dear, oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. Mm, I probably should have lit the Naxal's health. Alright, so... Friend. Yep. The tall jester before you takes a swing with his... It looks like a stick with a skull on the end of it, but it it, it, it still hurts on impact. Mm -hmm. Takes seven bludgeoning damage. Oh, okay, he takes uh, 15 ice damage. <laughs> Why is it 15? That's a lot because... of... Damage. Because I've gone up to to third level spell slots, uh, that has broken my armor of this though. So, oh wait, how much damage was it? Uh, fifteen. Okay, cool. I accidentally no. took off too much. No, I did fifteen. He did seven to me. Yeah. yeah. And Nacho. Yeah. Uh huh. Uh, he doesn't. He doesn't hit you. He's using his uh, weird skull club thing in one hand, and with the other hand, he reaches out and just touches you gently on the back, as if patting you on the back. But it doesn't feel all that friendly. Does a 12 hit? No. Roll me a con save. Didn't even ask me if it hit. I assume he rolled very well. He did. Okay. Uh, <laughs> as bliss. Oh, yes. <laughs> That's a 7. I'm Nailed it. Confused. Is this a melee attack? Yeah, have a sack roll. No, he missed. You're in luck. Ah. Sick. Uh, Meryl. <laughs> Meryl. Meryl's got a dog issue at the moment. Sorry. Well, he's a rabbit. Yep, all good. <laughs> he's getting chased by a dog. Meryl, the full skeleton figure before you seems less distracted and clobbers you with a great mighty swing two handedly. With his... Oh dear. Weird club with skull. Ooh. Okay. Another 23 hit. Uh, it will. Shit. Take eight bludgeoning damage. Oh, fuck. Oh, beans. And can you roll me a strength save? Strength save? Um, uh, that's my forte. Or con save, I guess. No, uh, no, I mean, I'm gonna, whatever. Uh, you get knocked five feet back. If it was a con save, it would have been nine, so. <laughs> yeah. Um, I need to make a con save uh, for my uh, spell, I guess. Um, but I have uh, advantage. So it's. Five. Pretty sure that's a fail, buddy. 
Ah, oh, can't. <laughs> so I dropped concentration. What were you concentrating on? Uh, my spirit shroud. Oh, yeah. yeah. Shipples. Yeah, that's all the minions. Right, the uh, the the far less exciting looking thugs are now going to take their hot shots. Oh god, I completely forgot that Donny that his portrait has been rotated, and I was just <laughs> staring at it, trying to work out. My god, how fucked up is Tom's character's face? <laughs> 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 I thought you'd done that as your last little bit of control. <laughs> oh, I still have control of the spin. <laughs> yeah. Does a 13 hit? Friend. Oh, yeah. Uh, no, sorry. 10? No. Okay. Yeah. Fine. Krend does a 9 hit. I'm assuming not. No. <laughs> the lower. These numbers are getting yeah. lower. So. Funny. Does a 10 hit? No. What about a 21? Yes. Take four bloody damage from the thuggish looking individual in a lesser outfit for you. God damn it. Oh, I see music. Alright, that will conclude their turn. The rest of them all just moved. Nato! Oh, I'm loath to use my bonus action to disengage, but I'm gonna have to. To get away from the big boy. And then I'm Big nasty. Gonna take a few steps closer to Punchy Boy. Whoa. And they weep uh, with bless. Roll the bless. Oh, just about hit. Uh, ignore the sneak damage because I don't actually have sneak attack. Oh, that's very true. I know. <laughs> A mighty four damage. Oh, that's good rolls. Uh, and then I stand here pretending that I can hide, but I am just going to use the last of my movement to step slightly further away. Yeah. Lumia! Right. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to move up and attack this guy. Okay. With my cleaver this time. Acting from the shadows. And then I'll retreat. Smart. Just hiding directly behind him. Uh yeah. Okay. Done it. Um, okay. I'm going to do a little sneak around the corner. Uh, I can reach him from there, I think. Um, and I'm going to attack Punchinello. Um uh... attack. What are you doing? 
Yeah. Um, so, Colossus Slayer. And How are you going to roll eight on that? Fucking hell. <laughs> oh, I still got one again. Good he's rolled. Um, and then I'll attack again. It's actually when it turns out Tom's just set his Colossus Slayer to just roll eight. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I can check it. It is definitely. <laughs> yeah, that hits. Yeah. And third time. Jesus. Fucking. Revised Ranger is a fucking damage fucking jackpot. Yeah, it's a shame Ranger is still shit. <laughs> Friend. Grand. Okay, right. If I move away, these guys are going to get attack of opportunities against me. Um, oh, oh, yeah, you're in melee range, so yes, he, he has reach. But... Yeah, yeah, exactly. Um, and I think with Salumier on the other side, my best option is I move in and I'm going to swing with my big axe. Um, I've got to find it in my list of things. Here it is. Pacha! Well, I'm sure. really glad I got the advantage for that swing. And uh, there's my second one. Uh, he died on the first one. Okay, can I redirect my second swing against this little boy then? I'll allow it. Smashing. Pachin, pacha. Pacha. Um, and I don't really have anything else I want to do on my bonus action, and I don't want to move. Uh, what I will do is I'll move to here. So that Salumier could easily get advantage on this little boy if he wants. Or just be out of the way generally, and I'll end my turn. Okay. It's to me. Mario. Alright, with a with a vicious cackle. The hideous visage before you is gonna cast an unpleasant spell. Uh-oh. That doesn't sound very nice. I'd say it sounds quite yeah. unpleasant. Why do I keep standing so close to him? <clears throat> so close to me. I can't see him as well. So I'm hoping I'll be protected. I mean, uh, uh, oh no, I can't, I can't help you guys out. Oh no, he's knocked down that pillar in front of you. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, it's landing on me. Oh no, rocks are falling. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, he cast Wish. <laughs> or Meteor Swarm. It's about to be like, Meteor Swarm will be fine, we're inside. Forgot how big Meteors are. Yeah. <laughs> it's gonna <laughs> really shake Cyrus's safe as well. The suspense, guys. All right, fail me. Punch is going to be quite a Ooh. theatrical character, isn't he? Uh, I feel like Sam's just recorded something. That's why he went quiet. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me I'm wrong. Uh, you're wrong. I don't think I am. Doesn't count. Oh. For it. Just picturing Sam reading through like a massive long <laughs> list of things that this spell does. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, I don't like that at all. I do not hate that circle because <laughs> I yeah, am not in it. With a and a cackle. <laughs> a le uh, an unpleasantly sickly coloured nauseating gas in like erupts from thin air and spreads to cover a large area amongst you <clears throat> lovely I don't like that don't like that one bit I don't like that can you all roll me hey what sorry alright you're uh, initially nothing. You, I mean, it's unpleasant. You're not enjoying yourselves, but nothing actually happened. We don't have to make a save. Not yet. 
That makes this much worse, you realise. That, that makes me... Oh, I have, I know what's going to happen. <laughs> in a second, when it starts on my turn. <laughs> and I start yeah. my turn inside the cloud. Yes, that's exactly what I'm thinking. <laughs> yeah. Errol, roll me a constitution save! God hey, fuck. <laughs> All right. Uh, come on, come on, come on. Big money! Yeah! Uh... Success. Done with the least enthusiastic way. Yeah. Yeah. Alright. Am I free of moving and acting? Uh, I mean, you're, you're, it's an unpleasant sensation, but you're not, as far as you can tell, nothing too okay. less impressive will go on. Alright. Uh, I'm gonna run over here. One, two, three, four. Five, and I'm going to cast uh, Spirit Shroud again um, as I run over here. Um, and then five, six. I'm going to try and get on the other side. Seven and eight. Just so someone over here can get um, flanking if they want. And then I'm going to do me a blue Booming Blade. Fucking God! <laughs> Damn it. Oh, poor Red. Never mind. Iris, <laughs> can't say please. Okay. Uh, Twenty-two. Okay, well, <laughs> Um, good boy. Um, cool. In which case, then Cyrus is gonna fucking move the fuck out of the way. Um, he's gonna go one, two, three, four, five, six, and he's gonna. So crossing the um the barriers around that like little tent is. Uh, an extra five-bit movement because it'll climb over them. Oh, right. Okay. Um, well, no, you'd be one square, but you'd be, be one square further back than you were, yeah. Sorry, I hadn't realised I was going to climb over. Um, am I out of it there? That's like right on the edge, is that fine? Or... Yeah, you're out of it. Cool. Um, in which case, then, I'm going to look at this boy here. And I'm going to cast... A little, a little sacred flame. DC deck save, take six fire damage. Uh, with deck save, isn't it? And I say fire damage, I mean radiant, but yeah. Deck save, yeah. That is a failure. Excellent. Six radiant damage to that boy, please. Take it. And then uh, as a bonus action, um, I'm going to try and push him five feet away. So he's got to make a DC 15 strength saving throw. Oh. Dirty little bastard. That'll be my go. The tall boy's turn. This individual seems unfazed by the mist around him because he didn't appear to have any lungs. Have they gone? The mists. You huh? deleted it. You deleted the mist. Oh, is it not showing? It's on the. I've moved it to a different layer, but if it's not oh, showing, yeah, I, yeah it. I can't see anymore. Yeah, 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 it's gone. Yeah, I think we can only see the token. Is it now? Nope. No. no. Can you see it now? <laughs> Hold on. How does your how's your drinking going, Dan? Yeah, there you go. No, yeah. enjoying it. How's your drinking going, Andy? Yeah, going good. Mm -hmm. Going good. All right, uh, Donnie. You got you got a guest. Uh oh. Uh, does a twelve hit? That does not. What about a twenty? That does. Take eight. Necrotic damage and roll me a constitution save, please. 
8 necrotic. Okay, constitution save. Uh, but it's a success. Yay! Marvellous. Your eyes. Maxwell, you are not hidden. You have a friend. Good. He attempts to beat you with his uh, small humorous club. With the stick. Uh, does an 11 hit? I assume not. You would be correct. What about a 23? That one does a little bit, yes. Eight, nine bludgeoning damage from the grumpy desk. Nine? Outrageous. Meanwhile, his cohort, adjacent to Krend, yeah. is going to roll a save as he started his turn in the cloud. Uh, I believe he passed with that roll. <coughs> oh, that's a nice burp. <laughs> oh, pass. that's a good burp. Oh, I'm going to hit you. Well uh, 11 will miss, but a 23 will hit. Take 9 bludgeoning damage. 9, got it. And then the one to the rear that you all seem to have forgotten. 1, 2, 3, four, <laughs> Not forgotten, five. hadn't noticed. <laughs> and he's going to attempt to beat Cyrus up. That's fair, I would too. Yeah, try. Yeah. That's the last time I hear you, Bish. Oh, <laughs> shit. Uh, all right. A 7 will almost certainly miss, but a 20, I assume, will not. A 20 will, in fact, hit. 8 bludgeoning damage, please. 8 bludgeoning damage taken. Good dead turn, Naxor. Let's get things, let's get the speed up. Oh, well, I think... I'm going to step around that boy. Uh, I'm going to bonus action hide. And then I'm going to whip the punch. You get advantage because I'm flanking? Quick of range. It's still a melee, but he just has reach. Mm -hmm. Oh. Uh, mm -hmm. In a reverse. Fucking, yeah, in a reverse. Yeah, yeah that I mean, thing. the concept of being distracted by another melee attack considers yes. So you can have the advantage, in which case you will hit and you will deal seven damage. He also would have got less anyway. Oh yeah. And a sneaker to Yeah. Oh. 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 The snake damage. That's good bad. snake. Good snake. Uh, if that guy does another nine damage, I'm down. So. <laughs> that's. that's With that dramatic series of events, I must go pee. Oh, <laughs> oh, I God. really thought Punch was dead. A really dramatic. Pace. I really. <laughs> for a, for a second, I thought I'd whipped someone to death. Again. Dominatrix Naxor. It's going to be a good hustle for my downtime. <laughs> Particularly, you know, as we're in a religious area and you look quite young. It's true. Yeah. Looks quite young. Is also seven foot one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I'm struggling to mentally picture that. <laughs> Just look at college basketball players, and then you've got it. <laughs> mm. Oh, my favourite Morris dancing song. Part uh, one with the with the bells. And probably, probably an accordion. And the sticks. Yeah, I like all of that. And like socks pulled up too high and 
right. old men with beards. Anyway, with a with a with an impressive flourish. That's all crap is yeah. frankly feminine whip. And punch all prone looking decidedly disgruntled. My whipping prowess has never made anyone disgruntled before. And uh, you, he starts to have what you can only really describe as a fit. Uh oh. I don't like this. Yeah. That seems much worse. <laughs> Does a bit. Oh, out of curiosity, is his misty thing a con uh, concentration spell? Maybe. Oh, yeah. Good question. Also, if he's on the ground, yeah! on melee attacks, guys. Wait, has the cloud gone? Yeah. Oh, nice. I wasn't certain if it'd just be moved to another layer again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Sam's just hitting it so you don't know if you're walking in it. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yeah, it's gone. Coincidentally, it wasn't actually damage dealing. I don't believe you. <laughs> <laughs> May not be like HP damaging, but it's quite damaging to what we're doing. No, trying it, to it, was, uh, it was stinking cloud. <laughs> right, fucking stank, yeah. Like, it, it poisons you and you lose your action, like, if you're in it. But... Yeah, like I say, that's, that's pretty damaging worse. to the That's fact. pretty fucking bad. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, but it doesn't actually hurt your health. Like, you won't die in it, it'll just be <laughs> so, It extends so the rounds, therefore hurting me. We're out here with weapons, and Punch has stink bombs. <laughs> I would sometimes take the damage to, like, yeah. still have my actions. Yeah, he actually just has a sausage in his pocket that he hits people in the head with, and it's devastating. I mean, yeah. I'm sure, has Andy just wandered off or fallen asleep? I think... <laughs> I yeah, think. probably. A <laughs> little, little bit of both. No, I'm here, I'm here, I'm here. <laughs> but it's your go, Andy, just in case you didn't clock that. <laughs> I didn't clock it. There we go. <laughs> I, was, I was looking at a Morris dancing face. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Come around. Because <laughs> you went, I'm here, I'm here, I'm here, I'm here. And then there was that awkward silence where you didn't make any <laughs> attempt to take your turn. <laughs> I, no, I'd, I'd looked at things in the turn order. Oh. I like playing this rogue, it's a very easy turn. Stabby. <laughs> Good boy. Yeah, Some... That is quite an easy turn. I might try and write, like, make a little macro that just does. So, Numia has got. Um... <laughs> oh, no, mind. No, mind. Um, excuse me, who are you hitting? You not pay attention? <laughs> Thank God. What with your cleaver? Oh, From that range. Okay. Can someone can someone verify that I did in fact go to he, he, he did, did move and did the attack and then moved away and rolled yeah. stealth. So Yeah. <laughs> He's right, just trying so to keep well, the momentum after disappearing on us. 18 damage. This playlist is called Incest and Morris Dancing. <laughs> Two oh, of favorite. Andy's favourite things. <laughs> Sounds like some kind of folk core metal <laughs> album. All right, so Lumiere has dived in, had a hack, and left. Mm -hmm. yeah. Donny, there is a very tall, very angry-looking skeletal jester before you. Did that not kill the little boy? Fuck. Uh, he stumbled, but he's still standing. God damn it. <laughs> that is a stout little boy. Yeah. Should I... Many a strength check. Should I try to polish him off? Or should I... No. Yes. Should He's I just polish him off? Good. He's currently having a fit on the floor. So yes, because he's there on the floor. A, there, have is advantage. A, there is a 12 to 15 foot tall skeletal jester next to you. He'll Ooh. have advantage on attacks against him because he's on the ground. Is that only melee attacks? Oh yeah, melee attacks. Fuck it, never mind. Don't have me. I mean, I could do. I could attack. I could do. I could attack. One attack on the skeleton and two attack on the 
Uh, but there's no point. If he's prone, you'll have disadvantage on range. Will I? Mm. Okay, that's, that's, that's dicks. You're dicks. Yeah. Oh. oh, fuck you, Dan. Oh, fuck <laughs> your face. <laughs> Is that, is that I mean, your, your bonus to hit is still pretty good. Like, mm. <clears throat> in like, yeah. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do one attack on the skeleton and two attacks on the. Um, so who are you attacking? First, I'm gonna attack. Um. What's his face? What is his face? Is that hit? Who are you attacking? I'm attacking him. I'm pointing on the <laughs> punch. Look. Look. 21 will hit punch. Yeah. And Colossus Slayer. Oh. Well, and thing. All right, punch, is, punch continues to fit on the ground. Oh dear. Um. Okay, then I'll shoot him with my second crossbow. Uh, that will miss. Oh. Okay, now I'm going to hit this guy. Oh. With my third crossbow. I feel like Donnie's just juggling fucking mini crossbows. <laughs> 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 you don't want you don't want to know what he's using to hold the third one. Yeah. Just fucking chaos. It's like, uh, have you played Assassin's Creed Black Flag, where he ends up with all the pistols strapped to his body? It's just that, but loaded crossbow. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if I scratch wrong, I'll kill somebody. I swear that was in a film once, where there was like a guy with loads of pistols strapped across him, and he would like... Uh, find yeah, the in, first um, Matrix film? <laughs> it's, uh, you're probably thinking of uh, the Boondock Saints. There's a bit where a guy who's got six sets of handguns on him just like shoots up a house and drops them and picks up other ones. I mean, uh, there is a, I think there's a scene in the parts of the Caribbean where the dwarf is carrying like a shitload of guns. That's what I'm thinking, I think. Oh, uh, all right, all right. He's wearing like six bandoliers and pistols and he keeps handing them out. <laughs> Donnie, does that conclude your turn? Uh, yeah, I can't say anything else. Thank you. Friend. Okay, uh, I, I've i got to make a decision here, and the only way I'm going to make this decision is by flipping a coin. Heads, I do the stupid thing. Tails, I don't. Who is this? Why is this heads? Do the stupid heads, I do. <laughs> Virus. No, it was heads. So, <laughs> <laughs> so uh, how is this like particularly high up or difficult to climb this thing? I know yeah, Cyrus. You're able to get over it. You just lose. You just lose five feet of movement by moving over it. Okay, that's perfectly fine. In that case, Krend is going to climb up there. I assume this guy's going to make an attack of opportunity. Oh yes, he will. Make the roll. Uh, I'm assuming a fourteen will miss. A fourteen does miss. Fantastic. Um, and basically, Krend wants to. Uh, how possible would it be to just tackle this guy to get him away from Cyrus? I mean, oh. on action to tackle him rather than hit him? I, it's, yeah, like tackle him means, you know, moving him away so Cyrus is free to move. I think. He, you or can put myself in between, I don't know. Can yeah. you shove as, as an action? Well, if I shove Cyrus out of the way, he might take the attack of opportunity. I don't want that. Uh, I mean, yeah, you can grapple the guy. Mm -hmm. uh, I could grapple the guy. The only thing is that's a that's a strength check, and I am not could very you, good. Could, at could you not just step out of his melee range, and then he'd use his reaction on you? Oh, that is true. Yeah, <sighs> and thought of that. Okay, actually, yeah, you know what? I've got the movement left, so I will step over here. Does he make an attack of opportunity? 
Yes, he does. <laughs> Go for it. Genius, Dan. I well, half expected Dan to just be like, no. No. That's <laughs> <laughs> what you're doing. Double 22 hit. A 22 does hit. Take, take, take six bludgeoning damage. Okay, and he will take... Uh, he has to make a DC 15 deck save. Uh, or take 18 fire damage. Wow. I'm a tiefling, motherfuckers! That That's rebuke great was roll. quite hellish. That is a really good roll. Uh, well. I, I, forget, I forget it's 2d10. Yeah, and it's second level, so... Mm. Alright, Kren, you done? Uh, no, no, because that's a reaction, and I've still got movement. I'm gonna move back and hit the fucker. <laughs> this is the most attacks I've ever done in my life. I feel like Tom. Uh, that will hit. Does the second one hit? It does. Okay, I won't bother rolling. Um, bless. So yes, that is uh, thirteen damage, and that will end my turn. Oh wow. Hey, well, this is hilarious. What? He did have one or... HP. <laughs> he, he did take two extra higher level cast off of Hellish Rebuke just in case. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Uh, yeah, that is that is Crane's turn, yeah. Alright. With that, uh you hear a, a horrified shriek from Punch. Um Has it become Judy? As the, the, the there's a lot of jittering going on. And eventually, a figure appear. Like it, 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 he, he appears. Essentially, something, something's occurring. Um, but after some time, you establish that what's occurred there is that the you appear to have exercised whatever was possessing Puccinello. Um, but he does now appear to be dying. The spirit, however, is looking really pissed off. Yes, motherfucker. <laughs> Oh, good. This boss fight has stages. <laughs> Yay! This isn't even my final form. Oh, no. Alright. Uh, with a cackle, uh, the the spirit that was Punch glances at uh, Meryl mm -hmm. and Taunts you for being a pathetic rabbit. Mm -hmm. so, Meryl, you want me a crimson save, please, while you are taunted. Spirit got him. Spirit. Jesus. You stupid rabbit. <laughs> oh, fucking. That's a fail. Meryl, you now have disadvantage on the bleach checks, attack rolls, and saving throws until the start of this creature's next turn. Um, ooh, those are the important rolls. And then, he, and then he's going to drift, he's going to very nonchalantly drift before you. And oh, he's far uh, away. Just delicately lay a finger on your chest and sort of whisper in your ear, Punch! Uh, no. <laughs> uh, right, you, um, can you roll me a strength check, please? A strength check? I mean, the same, yeah. Uh, uh. Hmm. That is a fail. No. All right. This, feel, this all feels awfully familiar as you rock it 30 feet away God. before you into the wall at the side of the cathedral. Not again! <laughs> and you take... Uh, D6 of damage for every 10 feet you've travelled rounded up, which I believe is 3D6. Okay. That is take 9 bludgeoning damage as you are catapulted into the wall behind you. Oh. 
you are you are decidedly groggy. Yep. Oh, I need to shit, I need to roll another concentration check. Uh I do have these with advantage. Go on. Yeah. Got a eight success. Still have my spirit shroud. Meryl! Okay. Um, fuck it being disadvantaged. I'm so fucking angry. Um, and whatever I try and do is going to be a disadvantage anyway, so I might as well try. Uh, so Meryl's going to, like, uh, shake, stand up groggily, shake it off, and then just run at the phantom. And then, uh... Try and uh, hit him. That will miss. Oh. Um, and then, then Meryl's going to fuck. Uh, I'm going to use my rabbit hop as a bonus action to get over here. That does not incur a tax of opportunity. Okay. That's uh, my turn. <laughs> All right. So, Cyrus is going to look around at all of the boys that he can see. So, I can see Naxor, Meryl, so that's two. I can see Donny, I see Salumier, and I can see Krend. Um, I can't see Punch from here, like the original Punch. Um, Spirit, formerly known as Punch, I also can't see. Um, so I can just see the five of our teammates. And I'm going to cast Mass Healing Word. Oh. And yeah. everyone's going to get just six health. But, yeah. No. There we go. That is six health. I thought Sam was just saying no to you. Yeah. <laughs> I it was. Well. No, they like, fucking oh, don't. spell works. <laughs> oh. Suck a dick. <laughs> right, um, I thought you were saying no to my being able to cast that spell. I was, I was upset. Yeah, I mean, so, everyone gains six health points, and then I'm going to move by passing through Krend. Move over here. Move over to this bit here. Um, <laughs> and I'm going to psychedelically push this guy five feet away from me, he's in my bonus action. So again, DC 15 strength save. Oh. Alright. Um, and then I'm just going to back up, and that'll end my turn. Alright. It's the tall skeletal man's turn. Uh, Donnie, he's really taking a dislike to you. Does a 12 hit? No. What about a 17? Yes. Take 8 necrotic damage and roll me a constitution save, please. Uh... That is a failure. Can you please reduce your maximum hit point total by eight? <laughs> um, he does have. Uh, oh, no, he doesn't have bless. Ignore me. No, he's not a sneaky boy. Creden's got the bless still. Never mind. Okay. You you, you feel uh, his skeletal hand just rest. Friendly on your shoulder, and you feel a life begin to be sucked out of you, and your hit point total reduces. That's a bit, Chamber. Well, shit. All right, Maxwell, I believe you're finally hidden now, aren't you? Um, no, I hid before I attacked. Ah, that was that was unwise. That was annoyingly honest of me. I shouldn't have said that. <laughs> yeah, the, 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 the ugly looking gesture to your, uh, to your right uh, hobbers you and misses twice. Haha, <laughs> you bitch.
Krend. Krend. Okay. Uh, is no, there... no, 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 Nice try though, because if you said it with confidence enough, I reckon you could have got away with it. I think I could have, yeah, go on. Friend, we have a 21. Yep. 9 bludgeoning, a 12. Uh, no. An 18. Yes. 10 bludgeoning. Yep, yep. 20. Yes. 7 bludgeoning. I'm dead. Uh, 21. Yes, so that's one failure on the death save. And a 19. Yes, so that's two failures on the death save! Oh, oh, oh. Oh, God. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Guys, y'all left your friends around in by a fucking moron. I didn't, I... I you just ran it. away, that's all you did. Hey, you I know away. what I was doing. I got in the way to get Cyrus out of there. You ran away and left him to I'm going to be buried with honours. <laughs> oh, fuck. Under the cathedral. After we burn it down. Uh, I'm so okay with that. Uh, I'm a classic bonus action hides. That's not... Maybe, maybe heal, Grant? Because, like... I'm too far away. I have to Damn. touch him. <laughs> uh, and then I'm gonna. Well, uh, put if you don't take out some of those thugs, like he's dead. Yeah. <laughs> but there's three of them. In one more hit, and he dies. Yeah, one one more hit on me, and I'm down, so they get an advantage. <laughs> like. <laughs> The odds of me getting hit is quite high. You have a, you do have quite you have four player turns before no in fact in fact you've got like a full round. Yeah 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 we've got we've got a while before full they round. get here. Kill them all and get um, Kren back up. Well okay. it depends whether or not we get that far. Yeah to be honest yeah. You uh, could yeah. be a corpse by the time we get there. Okay. <laughs> so I'm now hit it. so I'm gonna shoot this guy in the back. Roll attack. <laughs> Or do you get a uh, uh, bless D eight uh, D four bless 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 bless? bless. <laughs> and if you're hidden fourteen, <gasps> a, a a ten does not hit. A uh, fourteen with bless. Oh, a fourteen will hit. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He lies slain. <laughs> what one down? Uh, that is my turn. I f I genuinely forgot that I had a short bow. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yes. The uh, this individual looks on the edge of life, and this individual looks slightly more hearty. And I shall dispatch the individual who looks on the edge of life. He's dead. That is a shoddy stealth roll. It is. Oh, um, I forgot to do my wells from the grave. Can I do that now? Pretty please? Yeah. Uh, it's within 30 feet of you, isn't it? Yeah, so I'll do it on this big boy. Actually, no, I'll do, it, I'll do it on the spirit of um, Punch, because <laughs> that makes more sense. <laughs> the spirit for me known as Punch. Just, uh... Yes, I forgot. <laughs> the spirit is, um, it, it, it's like when you got a really bad connection on a dodgy analog TV. He's all jittery and fucked up. Yeah, you got you got to bang him on the head a couple of times. I'm trying, but uh, someone told me I should save you. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> it wasn't Krend. He can't talk right now. He's unconscious. <laughs> there you go, there's a nice little symbol to help you out there. I mean, I can't, oh, yeah. see, I can't see Krend. <laughs> Sumia, does that conclude your turn? It does. Donnie. Oh. 
Um, I'm gonna shoot this guy before he gives steals any more health from me. Go on. Um. Uh, uh, okay. A fourteen will not hit. Shit. Oh wait, no, sorry, Will. I'm lying. Mm. Uh, yeah. By the skin yeah. of your by the skin of your teeth. By the skin of my That means I get Colossus Slayer and Favor Foe. <laughs> is he dead yet? He is not dead yet. Okay. Fucking hell. I already had an out damage. He he is a bit wobbly. Oh yeah, it's just a skeleton. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. Grant, you feeling brave? Yeah, I'm ready for this. Remember, bless. <laughs> does that apply to death saves? Oh my god! It does. It doesn't stop when you hit zero. <laughs> oh no! No! Don't oh, fuck! He's dead. Good, he's dead. Cyrus, you need to uh, you need to praise Cred as like a saint. As far as I'm concerned, he dived in a way to get you out of there and fucking die. <laughs> there, there must be clerics in here. <laughs> if there's anywhere that's gonna have someone who can cast revivify, uh, it's gonna be these, a cathedral. These might be the clerics. <laughs> and, oh, and, fuck, you're right. and you know all those jesters we've been murdering? They might also be the clerics, <laughs> but turned also... into jesters. <laughs> All right. Well, um, I suppose that will end my turn. Yeah, no gentle repose. So whatever, fucking. That does conclude your turn. Yeah, I, I think a that little. I, know, I think it concludes your life, actually. <laughs> it might. I'll just, I'll just be tweaking my back up. It's all cool. <laughs> oh, uh, I love it. Oh, uh, I, I have more to show him why that is hilarious. Oh. Okay. <laughs> I don't like this game. I feel like I feel like there's more we could have done to save him. <laughs> uh, maybe. I was all ready for if he made that save of what I was ready to do, and it just doesn't fucking matter. <laughs> Honestly, as we were working out the turn, I was like, oh, the only person who can heal me before my turn is Naxor, and he's fucking miles away. Yeah. So, oh, I hope somebody's got something, or it's going to come down to the dice roll. <laughs> It was the fact you took two hits after the things as well. Yeah, it was. If I don't, if I don't, oh, the annoying thing was as well. I when I when I flipped peek behind the curtain when I flipped the coin to make the stupid decision. My stupid decision was to uh, attack rather than casting Armor of Agathis again. <laughs> <laughs> oh well. <laughs> In hindsight, probably should have done that. <laughs> there's a lot. Of, there's a lot of things you did there that would have been. Yeah, uh, could have, would have, should have. Either way, I'm dead. You guys figure out the combat now. <laughs> oh shit! All right. Um. Fuck. I mean, yeah. This guy. This right, guy. Uh, the, the, a bitch. The, 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 the spirit formerly known as Punch. Um. He, he shrieks with glee as he realizes he's, he's slain one of your party. No one likes to show off. And he's going to move slightly just over. Fucking yeah. God. Yes. Oh, he can't. Oh, that's a shame. You know what? He's just going to get all up in your grill, Meryl. Oh, what a change. <laughs> he just shrieks in your face. And can you roll me a con save, please? Yep. Yeah. Uh, con save. That is a failure. Yep. Yeah. Take eight thunder damage. Uh huh. That is his turn. All right. Uh, then I oh, I need to make a con save for my spell. Yes. Okay. Is it my turn? Yeah. 
Alright. Um, oh, you... Metal's so fucking pissed. Hello, uh, Craig. <laughs> yeah, it could be worse. Yeah. <laughs> Oh yeah, but like seeing his his party and his his new friend die, he's even more pissed. Um, and he d n is no longer with advantage, and now he's gonna try and hit him again. Yes, that'll hit. So four piercing, three thunder, and uh, eight radiant damage. Yeah. Meryl strikes out with his. With a flourish in Rapier and uh, slays the spiritual cackling beast. <laughs> you fucking dick! What a dick! I wish Brian oh. was here to see this. Um, with 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 that, the uh, the remain the remaining uh, human uh, jesters fall to their knees and appear incapacitated. Oh, yeah, they're going to be horribly disfigured. What about this guy? No, nah, he's still swaying. All right. Uh, okay, in that case, I'm going to use... So, I, wait, I used one movement to get over here. I'm going to use one, two, three, four. Um, uh, five, six... Uh, he has reach. Oh, fuck. <laughs> okay. Bring it. <laughs> I'll try to avoid him. Wing! Bada bada! Does a 23 hit. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, that'll hit. Take six bludgeoning damage. Six. Yup! <laughs> yes! Uh, yep, and then I'm gonna... Uh, I'm gonna... Fuck. Oh, hang on, for reference, the, um, the, the jesters who have fallen prone, they're, they're out of the fight for all the purposes. Yeah. Uh, okay. Oh, wait, no, I'm sitting on the... In, on why the... are you between spaces? Yeah, so, yeah, sorry, that was my fault. Um, and then I'm gonna use my rabbit hop to get the um, last bits just next to um, Krend. And that'll be my turn. Alright. Cyrus. Um, Cyrus. Oh, Cyrus is just kind of a bit shocked, really. Um, Are we all? Yeah. He's, uh, he's, he's upset. Um, doesn't really know what to do. Um, so he is going to cast Mind Sliver at the big boy. So make DC 15, well, that's a shit roll, intelligence save. Um, no, I'm not going to do that. Ignore that. That's not what I'm going to do. Change my mind. Sorry. <laughs> um. Am I able to change my mind, or is it too late? Go ahead. Thank you. I don't know if you've rolled the save yet, so if that helps, I don't know like if it was successful or not, and it's not the shit roll. <laughs> I just realised the Meryl really fucking hurt. I probably <laughs> need help. So I'm going to instead cast Healing on him and uh, cast Healing Word. And I'll cast it to level 2. And give him 10 healing. Cool. Sorry, Sam. Thank you. Can't get the star feed days. <laughs> I know. Donnie, your favourite friend is back for more cuddles. Oh, no. And he's going to swing at you with his big old club with a 19 hit. Yeah. Take seven bludgeoning damage. Oh. And he's going to pull you in for a big old cuddle. That was an eight hit. No. He, he somehow misses a cuddle. 
<laughs> he was taught to fight and not to love. <laughs> uh, I'm going to step over to Puccinello. I'm going to touch him with my healing hands. Uh, all above the waist. Puccinello <laughs> healing of all people. A third person needs to be in the room for you to do that. Yeah, I think there's more than three people in this room. Yeah. <laughs> There's one less of the people that we brought with us, but... <laughs> Still gay. Um, and then I'll step away from him, and I'm going... Wait, is that an action? Oh, shit, I'm gonna hide. <laughs> oh. In my head, that looked real. It was gonna be a lot better than that. I was gonna... Heal him, step up, whip the big boy, but instead... I'm going to take one step closer and just hide like a little bitch. <laughs> How has Sommelier got full health? The Lumia has 39 health. Because he's a little bitch and he's been hiding. He's <laughs> out of the corner. I mean, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Whatever he does, he hides. He's a, he's a hidey dwarf. Yeah, uh, I got knocked I'll, out uh, by one. I'll do another. Uh, uh, who who are you hitting? Uh, Krend. No, uh, the dude just next to uh, Krend. He's already dead. He's, like, he's down and out. No, not that guy. Not yes, he one. is. Yeah, it's just the big guy, Andy. This was a conversation that you've missed. Why has that guy not got a cross on him? Because, because he's they're not dead. He's been cured. Punch is dead, therefore all the jesters other than the bone ones have become like they're busy recovering from being... Why can't I hit this guy then? <laughs> because he's not a bad guy not anymore. Bad guy anymore. Uh, I mean, this it's, is the it's only never stopped bad us guy. before. <laughs> Jesus, man. Right, let's shoot him with my bow then. <laughs> he's dead. I'm still going to hide. As is tradition. Oh. So ends the noble life of Krend. Um. Oh. He had a good run. Um. Meryl starts like just like, just like tapping him and poking him and like um. Wake up! Wake up! Come on! Come on! Here we go! Um, run, run! You're okay. Iris, still he's okay. going to see if there's anybody in the temple left from the path of light. Help! So, yeah, for the, to, to enlighten you as to why that was, that was never meant to happen, per se. Uh, let me just share this with you. Got sent? I'll be honest with you, it wasn't my plan either. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so, when, when Krem went down, of the three thugs who beat him to death, two of them only had one hit point. Oh, no! <laughs> 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 like, like it, there was a there was a there was a multitude of situations in which that never would have occurred, and you only would have taken four attacks, not six, and it would have been fine. <laughs> oh no! The worst thing is, right before we started this session, I looked at my backup sheet that's just dob 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 dob, and I was like, oh, I'm not going to need that for a while. I'll deal with that later. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. Um, think they, don't, they don't even hit that hard, if I'm honest. Like, they, they had nah, some good rolls. Down, the numbers are they, they're irrelevant. <laughs> yeah, so it's, it's just the death yeah. saves. Um, uh, Meryl tries to cast Mending. Elmer is fixed up. He's the wizard. Oh, this no. is all he knows. So Lumia, he's... From, a, from a distance, is going to look at this look at his cleaver and like glint it off the light and then look at Nax, uh, look at Kren's dead body and then look back at his cleaver and then no just, and then just quietly sheathe it oh god i really okay. thought we were about to have tiefling sausages so uh, one of you needs to take right. Kren's horn as a trophy and just, just before we do this sam is there anybody that? left of the faith here yes we we run around frantically all right with, a great, with some searching and hunting about, eventually you you do find uh, there was it, appear, it appears that um, uh, it was what mid morning when 
Punch made his entrance, so it wasn't a particularly busy moment in the in the cathedral. And a lot of the no, it's a fairly large settlement here. There was lots of people outside. There's still plenty of people around. Um, they didn't kill that many people. And uh, you eventually, there are a lot of people fucking freaking the fuck out. But you do find a, a more stoic individual who seems more reasonable. And you are you meet Archimandrite. Archiman. Cool. Archimandrite. What for? And um. Cyrus is going to say to him, um, "I'm not going to try and pronounce that word, but Rockfort, I need your help. One of our, one of our kin. He's uh he's fallen. I just need. Can you res him? Can you, can you resurrect him? Any, anything, anything at all? We've been trying to save him, and then just like try and basically drag him back to where Krend is, and see if he can revivify him at all. If they have any ability to do that, yeah." yeah. Meryl looks. Meryl looks at him with the biggest eyes. The yeah. biggest rabbit eye you've ever seen. It's the. It's that bit from Shrek with um, the puss in boots. Yeah. But with a rabbit. Bearing in mind, I am of the faith. <laughs> All right. Rockport agrees that he understands your. Uh, he understands your pleas. Um, but he's he's sad to say that they're not they're not a magical order, so to speak. And uh unless he's mistaken, he doesn't believe anyone here knows how to run the fire the dead. And generally the Bath and Light are not particularly keen on bringing anything back from the dead. It's not considered particularly uh Avery as part of their religion. Yeah. Does he know any necromancers? Um, <laughs> necromancers knocking about. <laughs> Cyrus is just gonna say like you're supposed to be the part of light. You're supposed to help people. I need your help. Who can do it? I just he's not going to accept it. In 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 the in the resigned like old man way that old people will. Rockport kind of just kind of like shrugs and holds his hands up and is like, I oh, know I'm sincerely sorry, but there's there is nothing I can do or offer you. Meryl just dejectedly sort of sits next to him <laughs> and just kind of looks at him and is like, oh. Yeah, I guess, he, I guess he offers, we're burning it down after offers, all, guys. He offers his sincere, sincere thanks that you know, Krend you know, like gave his life in defense of the cathedral and, um, and insists that he will be given you know, burial with the highest honors in the cathedral itself. Uh, Meryl... If it yeah, if it seems like Krend is definitely lost, um, he's going to like try and um, loot his get corpse. back over to Punchinello and uh, say like, oh, but um, this one was the one who was possessed. I I don't know if you can save him. Yeah, I think he might still be alive. Yeah, um, you, you, as you approach Punchinello, he's already been he's already been healed once, and you know. He, He's for he's alive. Yeah. He's in a bad way, but he is living. Uh, oh, he's in a bad way, way, is he? <laughs> <laughs> um. What? Well, okay. Well, if it, if it seems like everything's sort of taken care of, uh, just before like <laughs> uh, Meryl is like sort of rests, he's gonna just go over to where the phantom was and just double check. There's nothing left of it. There's All no there is. All there is is like a, it's a pile of silvery dust, and if you sit, you sift through it, and amongst it you found a lump of um, uh, rock. I'll take it and put it away for a second, and I'll I'll check. I'll look at that later. Okay. Oh dear. Um. Well, this, this took a turn. Yeah. <laughs> Cyrus is uh, it's pretty upset. Understandable. Cyrus so hasn't, hasn't had to deal with death before. <laughs> <laughs> Apart from that one time he almost died. But yeah, on those... The, the, the rolls that killed Kren... Sorry, I'll, sorry just to clarify. Yeah, session, yeah. session end, session over. No more for today. I mean, mine ended a while ago, but all right. Yeah, <laughs> they only had a buff ball to hit. 
Oh, uh, I knew when I knew when I when you gave me that two-handed axe. I was like, oh, my AC goes down by two. That won't matter. <laughs> <laughs> uh, there were six attacks, and it was a five, a seven, a twenty-one, a twelve, an eighteen, a twenty, and twenty-one, and a nineteen. So they were all solid rolls. Yeah, all right. Plus two to my AC probably would actually wouldn't have helped there. Then actually, yeah, that was, that was beastly. Were, yeah, it's only a. It was a D8 plus two, like not. It wasn't crazy damage either. Yeah. I'll be honest with you. I'm very concerned as to what this is going to do to Cyrus. Honestly, uh, like as far in my head, in my head canon, like this is the moment Cyrus turns heel. <laughs> I call it. I call it like session one. Yeah, I, I can see Cyrus getting uh, Salumia to slice off Kren's horn and carrying it round on his round his neck. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Cyrus, he's just gonna go from bit. He's just gonna be, you know, suddenly become like a vengeance paladin. Might I might, I might take a scalp. <laughs> <laughs> Please don't Fucking scalp hell. my character. <laughs> yeah. Oh, dear. I will take the only horn that's left though. <laughs> <laughs> Can I can oh, I take dear. can I can I actually take the horn and carve it into the path of the light symbol or something? Actually, no, I won't. No, that that seems disrespectful. <laughs> <laughs> it's like full on mutilating can a corpse. Take, um, I'm like taking a finger. Can we take it in and can we just bury? Can we just like force the horn into the wall and just leave his corpse hanging from the wall? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no. that's yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a, that's oh, a message. Oh, <laughs> oh, that's that's a message. Friend died defending a cathedral, so he did end up as a paladin, so mission accomplished. Yeah, <laughs> yeah he got there eventually. Huh. He, he did, well, he got there a lot quicker than I intended. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to have to spend some time figuring out a backup now, because I hadn't done one yet. You oh, thought about that before you died. Yeah, that's really on me there, I think. So, yeah, I'll figure it out. <laughs> if you had one ready, you could have come charging into the battle. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It was not particularly deadly. Was it not? Because we have a bit of evidence to the contrary. I mean, yeah. <laughs> Tell that to Krent. <laughs> yeah. Honestly, no, there was nothing. None of, those, none of the enemies you fought did particularly high right. damage. But, but what it was, though, I can tell you why it was, is because we focused on the big bag straight away instead of getting rid of the ads. Yes, that right. is, that is but, 100% your mistake. Because if you, if you focus on the ads, the thing is you the made ads it very influence. clear. Yeah, you made it very clear in the last session that the ads are innocent people. And so we're meant to be good. To kill them, so, like, so, yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's, he used our own metagame knowledge against us. <laughs> no, it's not even metagame knowledge. It's like yeah, in-game yeah. knowledge. Because in yeah. 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 they all turned it's back not. to horribly disfigured normal people. Well, if you think about it, it's actually, it's exactly what... Uh, it's better than what the Fallout Punchinello... 4 ending. Well, yes, but that's not hard. <laughs> it's what Punchinello would do. He mind controls a bunch of people and then uses yeah. them as a wall. Because we don't want to kill them. Yeah. It's sensible. I don't like it because it got me killed, but <laughs> it's it's valid. I can't fault it. It's a very good strategy. Yeah. <laughs> oh, fuck. I don't know what to do. So yeah, Punchinello, he was, he was only actually possessed by a poltergeist. <clears throat> I thought they just aged you up. I didn't realize they turned you into a puppet. No, no. no. So the, the the spirit that possessed, possessed Punch, like uh, okay, all right. It, it, like when you met it and fought it previously, yeah. and when you fought it this after it left Puccinello's body, it's mm. just an old guy. It's not a particularly strong beast. <laughs> all right. <laughs> <laughs> you are on a poltergeist. Pretty fucking low. Poltergeist, uh, I believe. Cr Cr two. Ooh. Like they're really not very tough. <laughs> well, well, and Donny's that's... lost like eight of his total hit yeah. points forever. Yeah, fucking Salumier's lost like one. For oh, that was this um, session. That, no, that, that, that's life drain. That's not a permanent change. Oh, it'll oh, go oh, after a long rest, or yeah, it'll wait after a long rest. All right. Yeah, <laughs> if, if it was a permanent change, like yeah, that would be the end. Leave your character. Into HP, Max. 
<laughs> we turned level twenty. Oh yeah, got fourteen. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there are um, there are there are monsters that do that. That is more permanent than just a long rest. I think Mummy's Rot does it for a more permanent need, situation. But oh, restoration, gosh, yeah. Don't you? yeah, yeah. You have to get like uh, yes, yeah, <laughs> major restoration or something to make it go away, but. I'm quite, I'm quite pleased with that that one actually the map was good yeah, the map was, was good. very good I, I yeah good. the uh, I, I was so I was holding on to one of my spell slots um, because I I had counter spell that was wasted well the only the only problem was I ended up on this side of the pillar and he was on the other side of the pillar and you have to be able to see them to use counter spell mm. <laughs> so it lit it literally was just like oh shit I should have positioned myself better <laughs> Actually, something else to bear in mind is that what would have been, I don't know whether it would have been good or bad, mm. but I wanted, Puccinello had a like punch, Mr. Punch had a bunch of spells yeah. and some of them were, some of them would have caused fucking havoc. <laughs> um, he knew, uh, let me have a look, he knew some really crazy spells. He knew uh, Charm Person, which is neither here nor there, but still. Oh yeah. Yeah. Major image. <laughs> Invisibility. Sleep. They're all good ones. Hallucinatory terrain. What fucking level spellcaster is this guy? Uh, level four. Yeah. Um, confusion. What level spell is confusion? Level four. And compulsion. It's compulsion. a level four spell slot. Yeah, he's a fourth level spellcaster, so he has fourth level spells. That's what Fucking that usually hell. means. Yeah. He doesn't have many fourth level spell slots. He didn't actually use any of them in the end, but um, mm. no, compulsion, compulsion is dope. In fact, the highest level damage dealing spell he cast was Shatter at level two. <laughs> like he, he didn't deal much damage. <laughs> <laughs> he, literally all he did was what did he do in that in that fight? He cast Thunderwave, he cast Shatter, he cast Missy Step, and Stinking Cloud at one point. Like, Unfor wasn't your problem in that state, like in that fight, I thought. You you fucking cloud yeah. through his health like a fucking rocket. Like, he he had more than double the health of anything else on, on the on the field and you literally killed him first. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it was just annoying that his shatter knocked me out of um, hide, because then I was all out of sequence. So I oh yeah, that was, uh, I no, that was uh, Thunderwave. First thing he did. Yeah, so I couldn't. Oh, I was just all out of sequence. Why were you out Could, of sequence? Couldn't end a turn. Hiding at the start of the turn rather than the end. Yeah. Couldn't you? Couldn't you just hide at the end anyway? Why? Uh, why yeah, done? but having sneak attacks better than hiding at the end. By like having sneak attack for the that attack that turn, right? Felt more. Oh, I see. Right. Yeah. Got, got, yeah. got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Yeah. Hmm. I'm sorry, Dom. That's all right. It's, uh, nothing. I yeah. don't mind at all. But hey, at least it's, it wasn't uh, our yeah, session. Yeah. <laughs> it is still not not even <laughs> close to the worst character death I've ever had. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, even our, oh, our yeah. fucking Tom fuckery was... mass party wipe was better. Was better, yeah. yes. I thought it's that was quite good, good, actually. Yeah, it was good. That was fairly heroic. Yeah, you know what? I don't mind that because he went to heroically save Cyrus. Yeah. Like, if I'd have just died and gotten surrounded, I'd have been a bit annoyed. But I intentionally put myself in harm's way to protect Cyrus. And yeah. Cyrus is fine. So, yeah. yeah. If, um... <laughs> if the turn I order had been stab. slightly different, I would have been able to get you back up again. Yeah, like, yeah. 